British ship arrived at a South African port with her hull badly damaged, and for several reasons there was no chance of getting her into dry dock. But Allied ships must be repaired without delay. A pontoon, which substituted for a dry dock, was ingeniously devised and built by a party of Dutch naval shipwrights who escaped from the naval base at Surabaya in Java and arrived in the Union recently. The pontoon's watertight tanks were flooded to enable it to be pushed under the ship. The tanks were then blown and the pontoon lifted the forepart of the ship and left a dry chamber between the hull and the pontoon. The workmen were soon on the job riveting their attention on it. Not only did they have to repair a huge hole in the side of the ship, with heavy damage extending 75 feet from the bow, but the bottom had been buckled for some distance. With the hull high and dry inside the pontoon, the men were able to get right underneath the ship. They effected the repairs and practically rebuilt the whole of this section of the hull. South Africa's ever-expanding ship repair industry provides an important link in the chain which keeps the great Allied convoys moving endlessly over the seven seas.